Imagine a scenario where we see someone having abdominal pain on the right upper side of the abdomen and their liver enzymes just keep on fluctuating, especially in someone who has an intact gallbladder. One thing that we have to be looking for is those tiny gallbladder stones which flows down from the gallbladder and blocks those ducts from the liver. That happens patients have abdominal pain because blocked liver ducts, the liver enzymes go up. Now many times these stones either pass or change its position that it's no longer blocking the ducts. So then the pain disappears and the liver enzymes improve sometimes even normalizes. So one thing I always like to remember is right-sided abdominal pain with liver enzymes fluctuating, always think of gallbladder stones. Now sometimes there are not always stones. Sometimes we only see gallbladder sludge. What is a gallbladder sludge? Imagine this as precursors of stones. It's a simple way to put it. Everything that the stone can do, the sludge can also do. So sometimes we find all this and we do an ultrasound, we only see gallbladder sludge and not definite stones. That doesn't mean that's not the culprit. In many instances, gallbladder has to be taken out in these scenarios. Now this is just one situation. Obviously there are other conditions which can also do this, these fluctuating liver enzymes with abdominal pain. The most common villain here is gallbladder. We'll talk about the other conditions in a different video. Thank you so much. Please subscribe.